These guys are so beautiful. How's it going guys? It's just a quick video because I thought you might like to see this new setup I just made for the Western Blue Tongues. These guys are absolutely gorgeous. They look great in this enclosure. So what happened was I recently got back last weekend from a trip inland where I got a bunch of red sand as well as some plants. And so now I'm decking out these enclosures, making them look really good for the animals. And that red sand just makes it pop in here, I reckon. So yeah, that's their new setup. Got some rocks, stuff like that. Lots to explore, lots of enrichment they can get in the plant. It's just awesome fun. But um, they've actually moved down an enclosure. As you can see, I hooked up another Arcadia T5 in here. That was super easy to set up. The cord just goes up and connects right to the other one in the enclosure on top. But up here, I'm actually going to be putting some other reptiles in here. That's a different species from these guys. And I'm about to set up the enclosure. I've got to take all this out still, but it's going to be an even more of a desert environment than this is. So I want to see if you guys have any thoughts in the comments below what might be going in here. Spoiler alert, it's a really cool animal, really cool species, one of my favorites. And uh, yeah, look forward to that guys. Otherwise, thanks heaps for getting me to 7k subscribers. That means the world, it's absolutely awesome. And I'll probably do a Q&A video for that soon. So let me know if you have any questions as far as that goes. But yeah, that's the new little Western Blue Tongue enclosure. I think it looks absolutely awesome. I love setting up these naturalistic enclosures for the animals. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video really soon. Take care, guys. Have a good one.